I have been on this queue since on Friday evening, hoping they will sell, because uh, some of them, some of the staff told us that fuel is on the way coming, so we have to wait patiently. In the first place, they told us that uh, they will sell at the rate of nine, 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 nine oh four. But now this evening, they came out with another strategy that they are selling at the rate of uh, one. Is it one thousand one or one thousand or so? But please, we are begging on the federal government, please, they should look inward and then solve this problem of this first scarcity. We are tired. How much is a bag of rice in the, uh, uh, in the market? Some are buying a bag of rice now. You cannot get a bag of rice, uh, 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 72,000. No. It has skyrocketed to 80, 70,000. Today we came out around 5 a.m. to queue for the fuel. Really, they brought in the fuel. And they decided, they start dropping the fuel and they went and changed the liter to 904 per liter. We asked them why. They say order from above. And we said, okay, Nigeria was still ready to see by. But from that 5 a.m. till now, so people are here since Friday. So people slept here for over three days. And we came and joined them till now. They have not given a liter to anyone. They said they're waiting for an order from Abuja. And before the result of the price that they shoot up, I called my wife again to go to the market and get me a bag of rice because of my children. She called me from the market that the bag of rice now is 85,000 naira. We all came from Joss for like three days now and we are here. Like me, I'm not taking my bath for like three days now. I'm just hoping to get the fuel, then I'll go and load and go back. That is just my own problem. We have been on the queue the way we came since the first day. That's how we have been up till now. Let me, I used to understand from this thing they are trying to do is maybe they will hold the fuel, they will not sell for us. Maybe they will sell to the black marketers. They will buy for that same rate of nine something, then they will sell it for 1,000 something. I feel that's what they want to do. But what is wrong? We are um, the price of fuel is actually 9.99 here. And that's such a sad situation because I remember when it was like 165 and we were, we were all shouting and saying that's too expensive. And right now it has gotten to 9.99 and it's such a sad situation. Fuel is a very essential commodity. And if we cannot make it affordable, there will be a um, problem with transportation and problem with transportation actually also means that there will be problem with food exports and transporting foods and goods and every there will be a price hike in everything and that's going to destabilize the economy it will not be good for the economy i've been in town since morning looking for fuel you can't believe i came to town since eight o'clock i just got fuel now you understand so the, 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 the whole thing is becoming so difficult for motorists now the way this thing has gone up transport will go up food stuff will go up in fact Virtually everything will skyrocket. And it's not fair. It's just like somebody being in water, yet soap is entering his eyes. We are in abundance, yes, we are suffering. So our leaders are not even helping us at all. 